Hi friends, in this tutorial we are going to discuss about the interaction between, between P53 gene and MTM2 protein. P53 is a 53 kilodalton tumor suppressor protein that prevents cell cycle progression or induces apoptosis in cells with damaged DNA. And we have discussed both pathways in the last two presentations. In normal cells, the concentration of P53 is maintained low by a regulator protein called as MTM2. And we are going to discuss the interaction between these two proteins and how this regulation is happens. In normal cells or cells with DNA damage repaired, P53 is unphosphorylated. So this is a DNA molecule and we have highlighted the portion of MTM2 gene. Suppose this is the MTM2 gene portion. And P53 can bind to the promoter region of MTM2 gene. And these lead to the expression of MTM2 protein. So P53 is actually inducing the expression of MTM2 protein inside the cell. This P53 protein, MTM2 protein can bind to the P53 protein forming a complex P53 MTM2 complex. And these complex formation lead to degradation of P53 by ubiquitin pathway. And this is a degraded P53 and this is how the concentration of P53 is maintained low in normal cells. Simply this is a formation, there is a formation of 53 MTM2 complex and that lead to degradation of P53. So whenever there is a DNA damage, P53 is activated, P53 protein inside the cell increases and that is activated by phosphorylation. Here also MTM2 protein tries to try to bind to the P53 protein as it is phosphorylated it could not bind to the P53 protein. So that formation of P53 MTM2 complex will not occur and thereby P53 degradation never happens until the DNA damage is repaired. Once the DNA damage is repaired, P53 becomes dephosphorylated so that MDM2 could bind to the P53 gene. Once again, MD P53 is degraded by ubiquitin pathway. Hope things are clear. Thank you so much for watching. You are with biologyexamsforyou.com. If you find this video useful, please share and like.